A major conference is coming to Albuquerque this week, and it's bringing together a number of leaders in museum planetariums. The meeting is happening here in our own state of the art planetarium at the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science. And News 13's David Romero is live there this morning with the very latest. David. Good morning, Adam. Good morning, everybody. Well, you can see behind me just how cool the planetariums are and why they're so important to museums throughout the Southwest. And of course, there's a big conference bringing together those leaders from that. One of them here, our own Jim Greenhouse from the Museum of Natural History and Science. Good morning, Jim. Good morning. So right off the bat, uh, the conference is happening this week, and it's a big thing for everybody to come together for that, right? That's right. We've got people from uh, actually all across the United States coming, but there's a few things happening that people here in New Mexico can participate in, even if you don't necessarily work in a planetarium. We have a Mars workshop that's happening on Wednesday. It's mainly for informal educators, so people that work at other museums or libraries or things like that. Um, if you'd like to participate in that and learn all about uh, everything that anybody knows about Mars, um, you can uh, contact the museum and ask for Jane Abel, or just ask for Jane, because she's the only one working here, nice. and uh, she can give you the information on that. Oh, also, yeah. I was going to mention that um, today at 3 o'clock we've rented this laser system that you see behind us uh, for the conference. And it actually is, uh, we've been using it for public shows and we're going to be using it for the conference a little bit later in the week. But if you would like to come see Summer Laser Jam, which is a show that uh, you can actually buy tickets to and come see today at 3 o'clock. This is the last show we are going to be presenting to the public. So if you'd like to come and see some uh, the music to some of the popular songs uh, animated in lasers and you can also see our planetarium system is providing some background images and a full dome uh, music visualizer um, that's happening today at three o'clock you can buy tickets to it uh, you can buy them uh, here at the museum box office and uh, today is the last day to do that and this is definitely all the fun stuff because I mean anybody watching it right now can obviously tell I mean this is just something really cool that's provided here at the planetarium and in addition to all that we want to mention real quick here that tonight is lunar Monday so if you're gonna be and coming here tonight you can see something that's uh, all tied in with the phase of the moon right there and we'll be uh, looking through our telescope if the sky is clear tonight hopefully it won't be raining tonight and we can open our observatory up and you can look through our telescope at the moon and any of the planets that are visible in the sky tonight. Um, that's happening from 8.30 to 9.30. So, uh, and it's, it's uh, admission is by donation. So you can just uh, come up here at 8.30 if the sky is clear. And that's really cool. We have that little animated ant right behind you. So guys, you can actually see that for yourself in person here at the planetarium tonight. This is all at the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science, the big planetarium. You can't miss it, that big dome from the road. But uh, laser show, lunar show tonight, and uh, that big conference happening here this week is uh, to make sure that great places like this continue to exist. Adam, we're going to send it back to you. That looks awesome. Thanks, David. And by the way, the conference will go all the way through Sunday. We're going to keep you posted and follow up stories on exciting new changes and some opportunities that that brings to our own planetarium. To get another look at this story and with more links, go to krqe.com and the KRQE News app. All right, we'll send.